Thank you. Oh, you, you were finishing up that story. Art, Artie, if you just tune in, we're t- we, we've been talking for 40 minutes about Artie and John and their <laughs> show they did this weekend. So after the whole thing, I get home. I just want to have one good meal, something, you know, so I, so I order some Chinese. And uh, so I sit down to eat, and I ask my wife to pour me a glass of orange juice. She pours me a glass of orange juice. I drink, like, like three quarters of it. I start to pour more. As I'm pouring more, I notice it's the, it's the brown stuff in there. Uh, Oh, wait, what are you doing? <laughs> throw it up. Oh, wait, think about it. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to throw up. John, don't, don't. I, 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 don't. Oh, and I, 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 so. Oh, Jesus. I, 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 I. He's raging. John, go in the, are you going to throw up? Are you going to throw up? I want to get the story out of I want him to throw up. Oh, <laughs> funny. I, what I, was I, in I, there? I, 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 uh, so, I go, uh, Susanna, there's something brown in the orange juice. So she she looks at it. There's um, maggots oh. in the OJ. Are I just drank. Dr- oh. <laughs> I just drank. I, I, oh. Like three quarters of a glass of maggots. Oh. Oh. John's like gold oh. dust. <laughs> Just, uh, uh, <laughs> really disgusting. <laughs> you keep doing maggots? I mean, what what, what, well, uh, what, what kind of orange How juice? How old was this orange juice? It was June fifth as as the uh you know you know the the ending date on it, whatever. Yeah. I don't want to make you sick, dude, but maggots are born in feces. Yeah. Yeah, it, 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 it was one of those the calcium enriched OJ they make. Oh, you know? is that how they do it? And what's the maggot what, enriched? <laughs> oh, God, dude. Was it a big lump of maggots? They were all when we looked at the bottom of the glass, and I just drank oh. three quarters of it. Were all in the bottom of the glass. Oh, oh my God! I know. Did the juice taste funny? No, nah, it didn't taste funny. <laughs> it was good. Oh my God! That's awful. Where'd you get this juice? I, I mean, can I say the company? Why not? Yeah, it was Tropicana. Was it really? Yeah. Whoa! Uh-oh. Yikes! I know. Mm-hmm. So you know, I wonder. What I guess. Sue him? Yeah. He looks well, look at you! You're retching every time you think of orange juice. Well, it's my favorite drink. <laughs> Everybody sues over everything. I don't see why you can't get a little yeah, settled. You're traumatized, aren't you? But it, my wife saved it, you know, and put it at the top. I go sit in the fridge right now. Oh. The maggots. Yeah. <laughs> Great. <laughs> But, oh, God, that, that was gross. John's little fake throw-up session here might get him an extra couple hundred grand. Now, now I guess. Yeah. Oh, clear out of your mind. Think, whatever. Yeah, I was thinking that, too. He's going like, it's oh, nice. Howard, it was, oh, oh, oh. I'm not going to sue, but I'm saying, it. Uh, no, it, it, Howard, the thought of uh-uh. drinking maggots is totally disgusting. In fact, right. he never stuttered before he drank the orange juice. Why aren't you going to so you're so money hungry. I don't understand why you wouldn't. Yeah, you could relax and keep Hardy off the road. <laughs> what are the damages? I got. I'm gonna say, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what are the damages? What are the damages? The fact that I'm about to throw up. <laughs> <laughs> I guess if I. Oh, Howard, I. You know, there. Can I say the company? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can sue. I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can barely do my job. <laughs> Maybe there are damages. <laughs> well, I, I was doing the same thing last night. <laughs> All right, I'll say the company. I don't want Tropicad. <laughs> 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 what mental anguish? He's working up into the big lawsuit. <laughs> oh, I, 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 I don't know what my damn it. <laughs> I mean, I'm no lawyer, but. <laughs> <laughs> favorite drink. And I, I, I swear to God. <laughs> oh, that is like the wet of gold dust. You know what, Artie? Artie, I swear to God, I'm not, I'm not kidding around. I swear to God. I can barely... Uh, uh, uh. It was really disgusting. Uh, you probably have a lawsuit, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can t- I can show this tape. Yeah, you almost vomiting. Yeah, please, <laughs> Your Honor. When I think about it, I. <laughs> <laughs>
Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Your Honor. <laughs> Your Honor. Your, you, Your Honor, I can't even... <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, sir? <laughs> I'm throwing up. <laughs> no, that is really gross, huh? <laughs> See, John, like this, Susanna, I'll pretend to throw up. <laughs> You're out of your freaking mind. The e channel will have it on tape. <laughs> <laughs> That's Blind. part of our evidence. That's <laughs> oh, really disgusting. Man, that is gross. <laughs> yeah. What, how would you... It was like a big lump of maggots. Oh. A bunch of them in the bottom of the glass. Uh. <laughs> that was, that was Olivia <laughs> over here won't quit. <laughs> yeah, it was. Oh, my, it was maggots. <laughs> Howard, <laughs> Howard, off the air. I tried to tell you story. Wasn't I getting the same way? I'm not the goofing around. This guy. Well, you understand. Oh, you gotta God. keep it up. This guy. No, that's gross. Ah, yeah. How would you, you know what? Whether you're sick or not afterwards, I see people sue over everything. Yeah, it seems wrong that it should be in there, right? And you should be able to sue. June 5th is the date on it. June 5th. What's today? Today's like May 20th. Oh, so? Well, they screwed up. <laughs> you going to call Tropicana? Yeah, I told my wife at least call him. We'll get some free OJ out of it. Are you ever going to be able to drink OJ again? <laughs> I don't free think OJ. so. I don't think so. Free OJ. Yeah, that's a bad thing to say. Free Put that OJ. in context. Yeah, free OJ. Free OJ. <laughs> uh, that's a good bumper sticker. What were you guys telling me about the road? Um, I don't know. During the commercial, you, I don't know. Something about we never finished the story. But, eh, what about the cab? Oh, about how I couldn't get the... the uh, so, you know, they, they have my site next to Artie on the plane, uh, and Artie lifts the um, armrest. Right. <laughs> when I try to put it down, I couldn't get it down over, over his ass. <laughs> <laughs> his ass was on my side of the seat. <laughs> and I'll tell you, I'll tell you, that, that armrest hurt me. I think I got a lawsuit. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say to the airline? Got it on my back. <laughs> Wait, is my camera on? Ah! <laughs> oh, my back, that armrest on Continental. He goes right back to the story, real casual. Yeah. Yeah, so it was Tropicana. Did your kids see it? No, but my kid's been sick all week. Oh. And she's been drinking the OJ. So oh. You know, she's had a tummy ache all week. The whole family was Like all week, so now we think. I mean, and that's true. <laughs> okay. Oh, all of it's true. Did right? you know, okay, for, but I'm waiting for all these little freaking... Right now, Greta's an acting, right now, Greta's an acting class learning how to... <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 you got to... When you, when, you, when, you, when you pretend to oh, puke, you got to... No, 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 you try. You try. Tim, you're on the air. Hey, how you doing, guys? Welcome. Uh, I'm uh, from Central Ohio, and uh, unfortunately, I had to work that night that uh, everybody was in town, and I uh, found out that everybody was going to something. Uh, hey, Bobo, you're on the air. Yeah, how you doing, guys? I think Audie and John are out of control, man. I mean, Audie, when was the last time you had a cholesterol test? Did you have? You know your cholesterol? We don't uh, do that. Well, a couple of years ago, <laughs> it's got to be bad. It's got to be like five hundred. No, it's not that bad. It's got to be huge. It's not that bad. It's just bad. It what's, with John, what's with John doing whippets, man? What's what? what? Gonna get brain damage? No, you're not. It's, it's a mild. Of, it's I don't a, even understand that. It's all a mild that. dosage. It's not you. So you say it costs you ten bucks for three cans of whipped cream? Yeah, I said to the bar, I'd take everything in my wallet, and uh, yeah, which was ten dollars. Do you do the whippets right at the bar? <laughs> yeah. I mean, do, do they let you do that? Yeah, I mean, it's, not, it's not illegal. All right. It's, it's true. It's uh, it's, a, it's a whipped cream can. Yeah, it's his whipped cream. <laughs> but you know what, I already said that because the dosage wasn't enough, so I had to do two at a time. I don't know. I think I got brain damage. Can I say the name of the company? R Red Ready Whip. Ah! You're killing me! Ready Whip! You're killing me! Well, maybe, you know, this whole retching and everything is Ready Whip and not No, maggots. believe me, it was the brown maggots. maggots. Brown maggots. Yeah. You want to bring the jar in. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of maggots? <laughs> Brown maggots. I'm, I'm trying to just... Uh, so, I'm, I'm disconnected from the actual experience. You ought to bring it in. Is it a big lump of maggots? I'll bring in the... Uh, uh, I'll bring in the OG. I'll bring in the... Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> you know, I, I'm like... I, I can't eat bugs or anything like that. It really does. Well, no one can. Yeah, or who like, does? I can't eat bugs. <laughs> no, I'm, yeah, like, I'm, learning so much, I'm learning so much about John. You don't understand. 
Did you see Fear Factor? They can... the candy Did you see Fear Factor? You know, they, they can eat. Artie eats Bugs Parmesan, so. Yeah. With a little mozzarella, not bad. <laughs> Yeah, you don't understand. I, I can't eat bugs. <laughs> I think I understand that. Really we falsify. No. <laughs> so are we. Are you goofing on them? I'm not goofing on it, John. I just, you know, it doesn't really seem like you're throwing up. I could, I, I could probably throw up in two seconds thinking about it. What? I could probably throw up in two seconds thinking about it. Let's see you do it. That'll be good for your lawsuit. Yeah. I, 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 Come on, Brenda. No, I, no I, <laughs> I don't want to throw up. I want to talk about the maggots. Let's see if you puke. If you puke, you'll have a lawsuit. Yeah. I swear to God. Stop. It's true. Talk about it. No. They will. <laughs> well, I'm telling you. You can't, you can't fake that, Artie. You look like Ralph Cramden. <laughs> Talk about it. Seriously. If you throw up, you'll have a lawsuit. Yeah. I'm not kidding. I, I, think, uh, no, I'm not, I don't want to. Talk about the maggots up. and the orange juice. <laughs> no. Did you drink a big gulp of it? I drank about three. I think you're I think you're I think you're I'm telling you, this is what I was doing all last time. <laughs> you know, I think about you, Gordon. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. People should be able to see this. Give me another. <laughs> Jessica Hahn, you're on the air. Oh, lovely. I just got sick. I just literally got sick. Listening, I never drink a juice again. Listening to John's story. I just threw You could sue John, and John can sue <laughs> Tropicana. She, she could I join the class lawsuit. action. Yeah, you could join the lawsuit. <laughs> I just got sick. I'm not even kidding. Uh, it's oh, me too. Wait. Uh, 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 I'm in on the lawsuit too. Wait. <laughs> you know, I throw, I throw up if my back didn't hurt so much from that kind of seat. <laughs> All right, Jessica, thank you. <laughs> Jessica, checking in. Ryan, you're on the air. Good morning, Howard King of All Media. This is Ryan from Cleveland. Hey, Ryan. Listen, uh, I just want to say congratulations. You guys are on a great show every morning. You guys make us laugh. And, Thank uh, you. You're, you're doing real well, as usual, Howard. You're the man. Thanks. But uh, listen, as far as starring John goes in answering those phones, that douchebag smokes too much pot because he can't ever get to the phone. It rings <laughs> and rings and rings. It's 50 lines, dude. Dude, you're, John, seriously. Plus, I'm not even smoke, out there right now. It's the whippets and the doobies, dude. You're a freak. Listen, <laughs> 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 didn't mention the beer. Uh. Yeah, seriously, you're, you're <laughs> Stupid, stupid. But that's right. We still love you. Do a great job. Congratulations, guys. Thank Take you. I should read email. I should get to Gary Garver did a bunch of interviews. Yeah, um, you know, and I, I can't wait to play him because, like, you know, you, you know, me and Gary get into an argument every morning over something ridiculous. Right. So this morning I said something about you know, one of Gary's interviews about you know, you know one of the celebrities that I thought said, I think, he, I think he's mad at you for totally like a dumb reason. So I said that. And Gary's like, no, that's that, what? what well, you know, and he's like arguing with me because he doesn't think it's a dumb reason. But I do think it's a dumb reason. Uh, it's like every morning we have these like dumb. Why are you arguing with Gary Garber? What do you have to do? No, Gary Delabate. The last time we, we had this huge argument because I said I agree with you about the two hundred thousand dollars, you know, not being rich. We had this whole argument, in, 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 you know, in, in the office about it. So right. it's, it's, it's every time. So this time I just said. About the celebrity who's mad at you, I said, it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. You know, and then he's like, no, it's not. Well, well, you know, so you know what happens, Howard? We don't have an argument. I disagree with John, but John can't be wrong. Well, that's so well, well, an argument. No, no. I say, you know what, John? I don't agree with that. I think you're wrong. Oh, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, guy. All right, Andy, you're on the air. I mean, Richard. Uh, yes, Richard. I'm I'm currently with the Tropicana defense team. We've already worked on our defense regarding this pending lawsuit. Yes. Um, is it not true that he admits to eating uh, Chinese food prior to the orange juice? No. No, afterwards. Well, okay, well, you said the right, the... Uh I uh, just going nowhere. Uh, I think he's going to try and imply that there was rice in the uh, in, the, in the orange juice. Oh, and you spit it into the orange. It's yeah. just taking too yeah. long. Yeah, which is just okay. say you know what the rice from your Chinese food probably got in right. the orange. Right, that's not Magus. That's rice. Right. Mm. <laughs> yeah, let's go to Melrose, Larry Green, then I'll play some interviews. Melrose. How are you, Howard? Okay. Great show. A couple of things. First of all, I ran into Sarah from Joe Millionaire the other night. You ran into Sarah from Joe Millionaire. Sarah. Sarah Kozer. Sarah Kozer, right. She's on the cover very of unhappy. Playboy, actually. She was in Playboy. First of all, she was very unhappy with a few things you said about her. What did I say nothing about her? Was, nothing was airbrushed, number one. Oh, that's a lie. 
Then that's what she uh, another girl. It's not Sarah. Yeah, I mean, I saw her in person. You know what? Let her get naked in here. Let me let me do an A B on that. Nigga, please. Exactly. <laughs> then I, I said to her, "Are you ever going to go back on Howard?" Because you know, I'm a big fan of the show. She said, "Well, my plate is very full right now. I don't even think I have time to do his show." Her plate is full, which accounts for that belly being airbrushed. <laughs> Her, her plate is as full as Artie's. <laughs> Something tells me. She's a, a nice. She's a. She's a nice looking girl, but she. The body. In fact, the guy Evan, who was Joe Millionaire, said to me, "Trust me, dude. She didn't look like that." I'm not done. She said she got a more, lot more than a half million dollars. She got close to a million. I doubt that. That's what she told me. And she said that it was Fox's decision that Evan picked Zora, or whatever the woman's name was. Oh, get out of here, Zora. I, why why does Fox you care? Life of my mother, she told me this. Why would Fox care who Evan picks? And since what she told me at a club in Hollywood. You think Fox wants to? What difference did it make to them who got picked? And plus, yeah, exactly, they want reality television. Well, well, between those two girls, what does Zora get you that Sarah doesn't? Nothing. Right. I have no idea. I'm just reporting. I'm like Jack Webb from Dragnet. All right, anything else? Yeah. Yes. I ran into Daniel Baldwin, the same place Gary Garver did. And Daniel Baldwin probably thought I had a tape recorder, but I did not. And he was talking to me very badly about you. Daniel Baldwin. Daniel Baldwin. Who was even, which one is Daniel Baldwin? The, the, one, one, who the one who tore up the, the plaza. Oh, the one who did the drugs? <laughs> yeah. Right. Who, who cares what he has to say about me? You want to know what he said? Yeah. He said, is he still on the air? Does he still have a career? Yeah, I, on. Oh. oh, that's he's just kidding oh, around. Oh, come on, Melrose. <laughs> that's what he said, Howard. Give us a break. He's making a and joke. Howard? Yeah. <laughs> Don't forget, 10 o'clock is the E! Show tonight. That's right, the E! You show. You make one good point. <laughs> you finally got to something that actually makes sense. <laughs> They're running promos on E! Yeah, 10 o'clock. Our new time starts 10 o'clock, and the reason I mention this is because you're going to want to see tonight's show. Tonight's show is the drinking show, and I think Miss Butterface. Yes. Yeah. Oh wow! A, you got to watch it. Yeah, that's a better time slot. You know, cause, ten o'clock. You think? Yeah, because people go to bed. I go to bed early. I like people go to bed early. Ten and eleven thirty. Also. It's better for John. <laughs> Howard. Yeah. Well, you know, John doesn't Second like to eat bugs. <laughs> <laughs> John's one of those whack jobs. Yeah, and he goes to bed early. Yeah, ten o'clock is our new time slot on E. So there. Ten and eleven thirty for the second E show. Right. And, and uh, Howard? Yep. A, a, a warm regard to you from the whole LAPD over the weekend. They all, right, say, all right, Melrose, thank you. <laughs> you talked to the whole LAPD. Yeah. Steve, you're on the air. <laughs> okay. Steve? Yeah. Go ahead, you're on the air. What's that? <clears throat> I said you're on the air. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Steve. Hello? Yes. Yeah, hey, is it Howard? Yes, Steve. Yeah, uh, I was just listening listen to your show and uh, listen to John say that whippets aren't illegal under his camp and all that. I've been a cop for over 10 years and got news for one that aren't illegal. In a, wait, wait, in a whipped cream can? Yes, sir. Okay. Anything that's used outside of its express manufactured purpose is illegal. I mean, if you walked into a bar and you saw John sucking on a whipped cream can, <laughs> he would have to arrest him? You got it. We but do it all the time, with, uh, especially with uh, spray paint. But how do you know that I'm not sucking down the whipped cream itself? Well, brother, uh, you could be sucking down the whipped cream, but it's it's going to change your uh, your behavior. And you know yourself, you're not going to suck whipped cream out of a balloon, right? I think no, it's have not a... out of a balloon. It's out of a, it's out of the whipped cream can. It's out. It's the actual can. Yeah, I think John's got you on that. So so then you so then you don't turn it upside down like you would when you normally remove whipped cream, right? What? You know, no, this guy, up, right? no, this guy's right. I mean, you, you do it, you have it in a different position. Right. right. I, can, I can put it in any position. It doesn't matter. The air's going to come out either way. Well, so, okay. Yeah, but the whipped cream will come out one way. You don't want the whipped cream right. coming out, though. I don't mind yeah, at the end. The other way, all that comes out of the CO2. Uh -huh. it, it always comes out at the end. So you've arrested people for sucking on a whipped cream can? Yes, we have. We do it to junkies all the time to get information. Thank you. Yes, sir. Well, there's Steve the cop saying that John is probably going to go to jail. Good. Yeah, yeah. What are you in for, kid? Whip it. This is one junkie they won't get any information out of. Right. <laughs> I want to hear about my maggots. <laughs> Mike, you're on the air. Mike, you there? No, Mike. 
All right. Well, we tried. I got to take a break.